Okay, so this is a relative minor key signature. If you don't know what this picture is here, then you need to go back and do major key signatures. So to get to the relative minor, uh, you take a major key signature like C major, and you go down three semitones. So we find the note C, we go down three semitones. One, two, three, to A. So C has a relative minor of A. Using this one here, F, so F would be here. So one, two, three. That would mean this is a D. And so on. Take G, we go down three, I'll do D. One, two, three. Always down three semitones. I'll fill in the rest, E and G. And how this works is that these are grouped. So C major and A minor have the same key signature, which is zero accidentals. G major and E minor have one accidental. If you remember, they're on the sharp side. So they've got the first F sharp. So this is why they're called relative, because they're related. D and B minor are related. F and D are related. B and G are related. Uh, I should have already put this up here to remind myself which side's flat and sharp, because otherwise you get confused. So one more for you. B flat major and G minor are related. They've got two accidentals. It's a flat side, so the first two flats. So G minor has B flat and E flat. 